Hey guys, it's Guy the IT Guy. Today we're going to do part two of our video on installing the Android operating system on the Rock 64 motherboard, small board computer. And here, I'm not sure if you can see well enough, but this is a 64 gig EMMC. So without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, and sorry about my voice, I still have a little bit of a cold, so it's kind of hard for me to talk, but I needed to do this video anyway, I've got to put out another video, it's, it's been a week already, can't let it go too long, but our first step into setting this up, so that way we can transfer the Android operating system over using a PC, is, first step you want to do, is you want to use a little jumper, too close. Got my new phone. It's a Google Pixel 2, so I'm using that for recording videos now. This is a little jumper, and what you do with this jumper is you put it on these two special pins right here. These are jumper pins, so that way it'll hold down. Oop, I'm putting it upside down. That way it'll allow you to uh, basically, it's almost like bypass it see most of most. Um, it'll let you install an operating system directly to the EMMC instead of using an SD card. And the second step you need to do after you install your little jumper, which these are easy to get if you don't have any, you can get like a hundred of them for like a dollar or something like that. They're, they're crazy cheap. And next step you have to do is on your USB port on the top one, you must plug in a male to male USB. If I can get it to plug in. Oh, never did. It happens the first time. That must be plugged in. Now, what I do instead of using the RJ45 port for my internet connection, but you can use that, I use one of these little guys. It's a TP link. I got it for like seven bucks on Amazon. And I put that over on the high-powered USB port. That way, my data transmission does not slow down. You don't want to put it on the USB 2.0 port. It'll, it'll go a little slow. You want to put it on 3.0. That way you have some nice speeds going for you. And since I now have a video capture card, we will now switch over to the video capture part of the event, of the video. And I will show you exactly how we do that. Well, install Android onto our small motherboard. 